What's up YouTube? Welcome to the video. Today we are going to open the complete Mark II hack. They also released the Feast and Beast triple play in Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. Unfortunately, I'm not going to open the Feast and Beast triple play. I don't think it's really that great. And I also don't feel like spending $20, however much 2500 cop points is. So we're going to open up this complete Mark II hack. A lot of people in this game probably have salvage saved up. So if you do, this is your chance to spend some of that salvage. These are going to be dupe protected as well, I believe. That's what I've seen in other videos. The complete Mark II hack is dupe protected. We're going to find out though here in a second. It cost 1,000 salvage. I have 11,000 salvage and we'll probably get some more through these openings. So let's see what we can do. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you do, make sure you drop a like. Also, if you're new to the channel, subscribe. That way you can see my future and past uploads. Let's get in. The complete Mark II hack guarantees one Mark II prototype weapon, one weapon camo, and one weapon accessory. So we're going to get all three of those in each supply drop opening. Like I said in the beginning, I have 11,000 salvage. We should be able to open 11. We might be able to open more. Depends on what we get. Here we go. For the first one. Come on, give me something epic. Fibers. Scorchers. DMC8. Even. Keel. Alright, nothing good. I don't think that we get any, um... Ooh, look at that. We got dice. G-Rail Puncture. I like this. I like opening supply jobs with salvage. That's the best thing that they could put in this game. Uh, ghost. Uni Amped. Ghost Accessory. That's pretty cool. I think that's a newer item. I've never seen that before. Let's keep going though. We have eight more to go. Alright, so we got the wreckage. Look at that. There we go. That has the mo money on it too. So that's a new wreck that's in the game i talked about that in a video a while ago and i did not realize that it actually is in the game now that's awesome so we got the wreckage assault rifle it adds the mo money uh perk to it which just grants you extra xp per kill that's awesome i'm so happy about that and we got mr smuggy puss <laughs> yeah i got my smuggy puss accessory on I'm about to go in. I can see people saying that as they start each game. Here we go. We got seven more remaining. We're doing really good so far. I really like this hack. We got the Oni taken. Look at that Chameleon Assault Rifle camo. And we got the Kaken. Oh my goodness. This is the best supply drop opening I've had in a long time. And we still have six more to go. Come on. Keep going. Got the DCMA 1992 and pill bottle. For all you weed smokers out there, you got a pill bottle you can put on your, your weapon now. Alright, so we got five more to go. We're doing good. I'm satisfied with what we got already. And we got the raw thug. That's another mo money. Why would I get Feast and the Beast? Why would I spend money on that? And I'm getting everything that I'm going to get out of there anyway. I would say don't buy that. I would say if you have salvage, you're spending on this Mark II. If you don't get anything out of that and then you still want to, that would be the best thing to do. Spend all your salvage as much as you have on this Mark II hack. See if you get everything you need. If you don't, then move into the Feast and Beast. We still have four more. We've gotten so many new weapons. We got three or four new weapons. We got the K-Bar Bunker Buster. I've been wanting all this stuff for about a year. Now, the two new weapons that came to the game, obviously, I've been, I've been wanting the K-Bar Bunker Buster for a year in the Mark II variant. Doesn't really add anything extra. Gives you a little bit more XP, but it has that purple camo. For some reason, I like that. I have the Bunker Buster, but not the Mark II, and now I do. A year later, I finally get this weapon. We have three more to go. You guys don't realize how excited I am. We got the Dino. Look at that accessory. That's sick. Come on. Keep going. We got the beaver accessory. I think some of these are new because I've never seen a lot of these. Got the dino, that ghost. Got the beaver. So this is going to be our last supply job opening. Raider. Reaver. We had four or five epic weapons. New epic weapons that we've got out of the supply jobs. 
I am very happy with this opening. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please drop a like on this video if you did enjoy. And I'm telling you, don't open that Feast and Beast triple play. Don't open the Feast and Beast triple play until you've opened all the Mark II hacks that you can. You can open as many as you want as long as you have salvage and they are do protected. That's the best part. Everything I just got was something I didn't have already in the game. Unfortunately, I am putting more of my focus on World War II, but getting these new weapons and items makes me want to play Infinite Warfare. I got most of the new weapons that are in the game, so I will be bringing those to you as soon as possible. So once again, we opened the Mark II hack. They're do protected. It costs 1,000 salvage. I had 11 of them, so I opened all of them. That's going to do it for today's video. I hope you guys did enjoy once again. I'm going to go ahead and get out of here, and I'll talk to you later.